Nigga took some breaths for this one. <laughs> Look at that. Mm -hmm. Will Smith. Why didn't you apologize to Chris in your acceptance speech? Um, Word, bro. I was fogged out by that point. It's 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 all fuzzy. I've reached out to Chris, um, and the mesh the message that came back is that uh, he's not ready to talk, and when he is, he will reach out. Mm. Um, so you're not ready to talk right now. So I will I will say to you, um, Chris, I apologize to you. Uh, my behavior was unacceptable and I'm here whenever you're ready to talk. Um, I would have been like, fuck out of here, nigga. You got to shoot the fair one, bro. We're I want to talking, apologize bro. to Chris's mother. I saw That's the interview crazy. that Chris's mother did and, you know, that was one of the things about that moment. I just didn't, I didn't realize. I did not and, see that, bro. Yeah, you know, I wasn't thinking but how yeah, many bro. people got hurt Word. in that I wasn't moment. thinking, my nigga. So I want to uh, apologize to Chris's mother. I want to apologize to. Uh, yeah, I know you ain't get no Chris's pussy after that. Family, you did uh, all that. You still ain't get Tony no pussy, Rock, bro. That's you know, crazy. We had a great relationship. You know, word. Tony Rock was my man. Nah, word. Um, and uh, this, this movies, is this is shows, probably business, irreparable. All type of shit. Um, I spent the last three months um, replaying and. Tony Rock is mad funny, bro. Tony and, Rock is mad. Yo, bro, that nigga almost funnier than Chris Rock. In, For real, in bro. That moment. You ever seen the show um, All of Us? Watch that show, bro. That I'm shit is to Tony Rock is hilarious, right now, bro. Oh, I can aside. say to all of you, there is no part of me that thinks that was the right way to behave in that moment. There's no part of me that thinks that's the optimal way to handle a feeling of disrespect or or insults. Mm -hmm. At least he's taking accountability, bro. A lot of niggas can't tell do shit like do this, something. bro. I'm not even gonna lie. At no. least he's taking accountability, um, bro. Like it's like, you know, I'm I made a choice on my own from my own experiences, from my history with Chris, Jada had nothing to do with it. Uh, I'm sorry, babe. Um, babe? I want to say sorry to my, my kids and, and my family for the heat that I brought on. This nigga is crazy. All of us. Uh, to all sick. my fellow nominees. You bro, know, this is a community. Nigga dick. It's like I won because you you voted for me. I can't come me. back from it, that, bro. It, it if you really suck another nigga, nigga dick, I cannot come back from that. You my girl is over his clip. And you sucked another nigga dick. Your moment. It's over, bro. Um, Publicly. I can still fuck? see Quest Love's It eyes. embarrassed you know, me. It, it, it happened me on Quest Love's uh, oh, award. And, you know, it's like I'm I'm... I'm sorry really isn't <laughs> sufficient. Look at that. So if I, what if would I do you this, say that to the I'm people old. who looked up to you before the slap or people who expressed <laughs> that the you slap. let them down? <laughs> um, this nigga killing so me there's two this, things. One, golf, um, disappointing people is golf, my please. central trauma. Um, I hate when... I let people down. Yeah, um, me too, so bro. it. Oh, jokes aside, I don't like that it shit, bro. It hurts. No word. Uh, it hurts me psychologically and emotionally to yeah, know word. I didn't live up to my full uh, potential. people's image and impression of me. Mm -hmm. And the work I'm trying to do is I am deeply remorseful mm -hmm. and I'm trying to be remorseful without being ashamed of myself, mm -hmm. right? I'm human and I made a mistake mm -hmm. and I'm trying not to think of myself as a piece of shit. Um, so I would say wow. to those people, I know 
It was confusing. I know it was Nah, this shocking. was an apology. This was um, an apology, bro. She was like, what, 10 I, minutes? I promise you, I am uh, deeply devoted and committed to putting using big light words and all that, bro. This nigga sincere, bro. He mean that world. shit. And, this nigga using big words, you know, bro. Nigga said, I am if apologetic, you, if you hang enthusiastic. On, I promise we'll be able to be <laughs> friends again. God damn, my nigga, we get it. The fuck? Now, I ain't gonna lie, bro. That was an apology. I understand he slapped the shit out of him, bro. But it's like, bro, he addressed it. You know what I'm saying? He took full accountability. He said that it wasn't about Jada. He said it was about something else. That was Cap. You get what I'm saying? Because at first, you was laughing. So it's like, I don't know, bro. I don't know if it was sincere, if it wasn't sincere. Because certain things that he was saying, it was it was, it was was real shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, he was taking accountability. But certain shit that he was saying, it just was like, nah, bro. That wasn't the case, bro. Like, the Jada shit. Talking about, oh, it had nothing to do with Jada. That was Cap, bro. When, was when he first said the joke, you was laughing. You wasn't like, oh, that was disrespectful. You didn't have a frown on your face. You was laughing, bro. You feel what I'm saying? So it's like, after Jada probably looked at you or gave you the side eye, because she wasn't laughing. She was the only one in the whole, how you say it, bro? The whole fucking, the whole Oscars uh, uh, arena or fucking, what the fuck is it called, bro? Uh, assembly, whatever the fuck shit is called. She was the only one not laughing, bro. Like, gangster. Everybody else was, ah, <laughs> she was the only one, like, like, doing a little side-eye shit, and then you looked at her, and then you lashed out, bro. Stop capping, bro. Just admit it. Like, stop trying to say, trying to make, trying to make it seem like you and Chris really had beef. Y'all didn't have no beef, bro. Because when he said the joke, first of all, if y'all really had beef, he would have never said the joke. Gangster, that's number one. Number two, if he, if you really had beef with him, why would you laugh in the beginning, bro? Because when, when he first, yo, G.I. Jazz, you can't wait to see. You like, <laughs> Born like rage, fucking your bitch every day. Keep a pack, never hopping the jigs, cashing out, fell off the bank. She looking at me and she like.